Hey everyone, in today's quick video, I want to show you a really easy and fast way to fill out and sign any PDF right on your phone. This works for iPhones and for Android phones. And this app is from the same company that basically invented PDF Adobe. So it's gonna be really secure and really easy to use. Let's jump in here. The app is called Adobe Fill and Sign. Let me go ahead and open it up here and you can see it has a really high rating and it's available for Android too. It's the same name over on Android. And this app does ton of stuff besides just filling out and signing PDF. You could actually scan documents with it. So you could use your phone to take a picture. I'll show you that and turn something into a PDF. Again, you could sign, you could fill and you could share it really, really easy. I'll put a couple of links below this video to the iOS version of this app and to the Android version of it too. So you could just click those, jump into this page, and then I'll show you around from here. And here is the home page. I skipped the sign in page, but it is recommended that you sign in so everything gets saved up. But if you don't and you skip that, you get to this page. Now there's a sample PDF that comes with the app so I could show you how it works. And then I'll show you how to scan one here too. So this is all you see on this page. All you see is select the form. So if you press this option, it shows you all the different ways you could bring in a document into here from email attachment to taking a picture to the stuff that's already on your phone or searching the web. Okay, so those are all available. But if you open up the sample here, this is the sample document they give you. And I'm gonna go ahead and zoom in here. And basically to fill this out, it's really, really simple. Just click where you wanna put something i already typed in a field there but the address field here i'll select it let me go ahead and delete that one so you select it wherever you want to type so first name typing your name here okay and that's it that's all it takes you could make the font smaller or bigger just like that you could delete something now i could just go ahead and click away or click somewhere else and type in another field okay just type in text here and then when you're done just click away to another section and fill it out and checkboxes work the same way you just select the checkbox and it fills it in for you okay and then the signature part usually you have data and signature on the bottom of forms all you have to do for that is press this pen icon and let me delete this you could go ahead and create a signature so it's going to flip the phone sideways so you would draw out your signature here and then you could go ahead and use this signature here i'll press done and there's my signature, I could bring it down on top of that line just like that. So now I filled out this form, I signed it, and then I could go ahead and press done, and it's done, it's over here. Let me go back to it, and everything is saved. Now I could go ahead and share it right here, and then I could email it to myself, text it, or email it to someone else. Let me also show you this person icon here. This lets you pre-fill your profile, so when you go into fill out a form, all this information would be easier to access and to use if you fill this out first. And let me go ahead and press done so I could show you how to bring in a document. Okay, so I'll press this option right here. I'll show you how to take a picture of a document. Let's go ahead and do that. Let me bring in uh, a document that I have here, a PDF document. So let me move this over and just go ahead and frame up your document here and take a picture. And I'll say use this picture. Let me move this out of the way. And I'm going to press done on top. And it just scanned that document for me. I do have some options on the bottom of this page, like adding uh, an adjustment to it for making it brighter. I could go ahead and crop it if it didn't scan it correctly. Let's say I'm done. I'll press done. And now it's going to open up the document where, again, I could tap anywhere and fill out that document. So I could tap here and type text and then press done or click away. And it's filling out those forms for me just like before. And if I want to sign it, I could go ahead and sign it. It's going to add my signature. I can move my signature where I want. I can make it bigger here by stretching it out. So you get the idea pretty easy right here. Done. And if you want to search the web, so I'll do a URL or a web search here. And let's just look up PDF sample. So here's a sample. I'll select this and I could just go ahead and fill this out from the web. So you just select it this way. It opens it up for you. Again, you could go ahead and tap and add signature, initials, whatever you want, make things bigger, smaller, put them wherever you like. Let me put this over here. Here we go. Press done. Okay. And all of them get saved here, all your recent documents. And anytime you could select one of them again, press this icon and it lets you send it to people, airdrop if you're using the iPhone here, 
or you could go ahead and print it directly from here or you could go ahead and email it to yourself if you like. So for example, if I text it to myself, I could do this, send it as a text message. Now there are more to this than what I showed you and there are some paid upgrades too and there's a limitation on the free version of this, but you do have a free trial too that gets you unlimited options for seven days. But I'll put a link more to the resources that Adobe gives you. If you use this all the time, you do have to pay. So this does get you going for a little bit and then after that it becomes a paid option, but it is by far the easiest and best way to fill out a PDF on any mobile device and they do have a website too to do the exact same thing. For my review, I'm gonna give this app a solid five out of five. It took me maybe like three minutes to really learn everything there was to know about the app. I read the Q&A on their website. It has a lot more to offer with the paid version, but this really got me going and it easily signed a PDF document and filled it out for me. Thanks so much for watching this video. Make sure you subscribe if you wanna see easy to follow app videos just like this one and I'll see you next time.